Hello, I wanted to show you a neat tool I use to make terminal graphics and diagrams. Um, it's not a modern tool, it's a shareware utility from 1993. Uh, it's called the Draw, and it's designed for MS-DOS, but it still works perfectly on Linux. Um, I think you'll enjoy it, let's take a look. Now, because this is shareware, I thought it might make a fun story to try registering it all these years later. Uh, unfortunately, after a little bit of research, I don't think that's going to work. The Draw has good mouse support, so you can draw lines, move and select areas, copy and paste and so on. Um, I usually prefer to use the keyboard, but I'm trying to use both just to demonstrate for now. Now, I'm not an artist, I just use the Draw to make diagrams. Um, but I'll try my best and I'll try to draw a picture just so you can see how it works. You can see this palette menu that gives you quick access to colours and characters. You can draw shapes and fill patterns and boxes and create sprites and paintbrushes. Um, it's a surprisingly capable tool. Okay, now that we have this picture, we can display it on the terminal whenever we want. Uh, that doesn't look quite right, but don't worry, there's a secret. Uh, the draw saved it in CP437. All we have to do is translate that into something modern, like UTF-8. There we go. Uh, maybe I'll show it every time I log in. <laughs> isn't, that, isn't that fun? Here's an example of something I use the draw for a lot. I make these cheat sheets for key bindings. Uh, I would never remember all of these, so I make these little side panels to remind me. Um, I'll show you what it looks like when I'm editing it. Well, I hope you enjoyed this look at the drawer. Uh, you can do so much more with it than this, but I just wanted to show it to you and see how it done so you can see how it works. Um, I guess that's it for now, but thanks for watching.